What is PCOS, luteal phase defect and how it can cause infertility? The luteal phase is one stage of your menstrual cycle. It occurs after ovulation when your ovaries release an egg and before your period starts. During this time, the lining of your uterus normally gets thicker to prepare for a possible pregnancy. If you have a luteal phase defect, that lining doesn't grow properly each month. This can make it difficult to become or remain pregnant. A luteal phase defect can happen to you if your ovaries don't release enough progesterone or if the lining of your uterus doesn't respond to the hormone. The condition has been linked to many health problems, including things like anorexia, endometriosis, extreme amounts of exercise, hyperprolactinemia, too much of a hormone that's responsible for making breast milk, obesity, thyroid disorders, polycystic ovary syndrome. Many times if you treat those conditions, you can correct your luteal phase defect. When you have luteal phase defect, you may notice problems such as more frequent periods, miscarriage, trouble getting pregnant, spotting between periods. Keep in mind that every woman can have luteal phase changes from time to time. What you do for this condition depends on your overall health and whether or not you are trying to get pregnant. You'll need treatment, of course, if you have any health problems that can lead to luteal phase defect. Your doctor will suggest you the appropriate diagnosis and treatment. Now, let us have a look at PCOS as it is the most common cause of infertility. PCOS, polycystic ovary syndrome, is a syndrome or group of symptoms that affects the ovaries and ovulation. Its three main features are cysts in the ovaries, high levels of male hormones, irregular or skipped periods. In PCOS, many small, fluid-filled sacs grow inside the ovaries. The word polycystic means many cysts. These sacs are actually follicles, each one containing an immature egg. The eggs never mature enough to trigger ovulation. The lack of ovulation alters levels of estrogen, progesterone, FSH and LH. Estrogen and progesterone levels are lower than usual, while androgen levels are higher than usual. Extra male hormones disrupt the menstrual cycle, so women with PCOS get fewer periods than usual. Women with PCOS are twice as likely as women without the condition to deliver their baby prematurely. They are also at greater risk for miscarriage, high blood pressure and gestational diabetes. However, women with PCOS can get pregnant using fertility treatments that improve ovulation. Losing weight and lowering blood sugar levels can improve your odds of having a healthy pregnancy.